<laughs> Hello everybody, it's your boy, CJ Teriaga, and welcome to my Broly Collection. Now, today's video I want to talk about something special, something unique. Let's get into it. So in today's video I want to talk about Lego Bionicle, which is actually one of my childhood... Uh, figures and which theoretically I should put on a nostalgia couch but because this is such a huge part of my childhood I figured I'm going to make this just its own little series kind of like along with the Brolies I'm going to do a Bionicle series so Lego Bionicle what is a Lego Bionicle let me show you this is a Lego Bionicle Tahu Nova or Nova Tahu. And this is a, a series two, or it's basically like wave three or four, um, where they introduce some villains after they introduce wave one, which are these guys. And after a few villains like the Rakshi, they then introduce these guys. And uh, no, not Rakshi, Bull Rock. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. I'm, I'm thinking of the movie, and I remember they said Bull Rock, not Rakshi. So, these are Toa. This is a Toa Nova. And then we got Rakshi and Bo Rock. Let me show you those. Alright, so, this is a Toa, aka Lego Bionicle's main heroes. Then we also have the Lego Bionicle Bull Rock, which are basically the Lego Bionicle villains. And then in the later series, which these guys come into play, the Rakshi are the new villains, along with a, uh, a, a main bad known as Makuta. I don't have Makuta, so that's why he's not up here. But these are the ones that are kind of like in this era. So these guys fought these, which are the regular Toa. These guys fought these, and these are the Toa Nuva. What is the difference? These guys are basically just bigger, beefier, more veteran-like versions of these guys. These guys I've seen stuff that, that they're basically the same characters. Um, there's a Tahu uh, in this line, but he's not as big and bulky as this one. So I'm imagining this is an evolved version of these guys. Anywho, I'm getting a little off track. So there's a lot of lore when it comes to Bionicles. A lot of lore. And, um, well, frankly, uh, I know you guys probably want to see the unboxing. So, I'll just go over it real quick. These are con construction figures where you can just move things and they do actions. Basically, it's kind of like the Legos version or the Le Lego take on an action figure, so to speak. Each of these figures have their own little action where they do things. Um, and, yeah... So, I mean, even the bull rock here, they have a little feature where they jut their head out. And when we, un when we open up this guy, I'll go ahead and show you his action. But, so, let's go ahead and get into the unboxing.
And that is a Lego Bionicle Onua in number 8532. And uh, yeah, it's a pleasant little unboxing. And here is his action. Now, I believe he's supposed to come with gears on the back here. He might be missing them, but um, I believe so. Yeah. yeah, I guess he's missing a few parts, which is okay. Okay. Um, I mean, the fact that I got the canister and the manual with him is just already phenomenal in and of itself. So to get a mostly complete figure is also really good. So, but yeah really happy about it and uh so as you saw the price was $5.99 I got this at a local thrift shop and my mother she found it and she wanted to get it for me for my birthday and it was an early birthday present so I was like thank you very much because she knows I love Bionicles they're one of my childhood memories like this is a great deal of my childhood and so it was pretty cool to kind of see it again you know it just it blew my mind when she came over and showed it to me and uh yeah honestly these figures are really cool that, that's kind of the reason why this guy turned into a lego the the lego skull you know usually i have just a regular skull here but because we're dealing with lego bionicle i brought him out and so um yeah from now on if, if you see this guy You'll know. But yeah, so I just want to say thank you very much, Mom, for getting this for me, especially for my birthday, which is coming around the corner. And um, I hope you guys take care. I'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Bye-bye.